issue. They are sisters, okay? They are twins. Oh, that's too much glitter. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley and today I'm going to be showing you a natural, soft, everyday makeup look. I do this makeup basically everywhere I go. I am boring and I don't like to change things up in my life because I have what they call commitment issues. So I never dye my hair, I never commit to bangs, and I never change my makeup look. So that's practically it. Basic Joe. Um, and also, thank you for 212... Two, oh, where's my phone? Thank you for like 214 subscribers in like literally a week. That's so many people and I'm so glad that you guys like my content. Hopefully, maybe enough for you to subscribe. And I'm honestly so, so grateful for every single one of you. And yeah. <laughs> Love you all. That's practically it. I will see you guys when I have no makeup. And so on. here I am, bare face, El Natural. I woke up like this. But here's my dark circles. It looks like I haven't slept in days. But it's okay. You can cover it up. So first, I'm just clipping back my hair so it doesn't get in the way. And I'll get to see my freaking forehead. <laughs> Before I start anything, I do moisturizer. And I'm using the Neutrogena Hydro Boost right here. Give it a generous amount. Don't forget the neck. Else, I'm just gonna do my eyebrows first. I don't do much with it. I just follow my natural art. Okay, I know what you're thinking. Ashley, your eyebrows aren't even. What the heck? I know. They are sisters, okay? They aren't twins. It's okay if they're uneven. I'm not perfect. We all have our imperfections, and for me, that's uneven eyebrows, and that's okay. Cause with the power of makeup, we can fix it. Okay, now that I just finished my eyebrows, I'm gonna work on my under eye. This is the part that actually takes me the longest, just because I have really bad dark circles, so I try my best to cover them. I'm using a under eye brightener. Put under my eyebrow. Under my bags. What the heck? That looks so. With my clean fingers, I'm just gonna pat it into my skin. So after I brighten my under eye, I'm gonna be using a little bit of a lighter concealer under my eyes just to brighten it up. And I'm just gonna place it like so. Oh my gosh. Now, before I do the second coat of concealer, I'm actually gonna curl my lashes and do my eyeliner. I was hardcore struggling when I was doing my eyeliner on camera, so saving myself from the embarrassment from the public eye, and I decided to do it off camera. Here's how it looks. It's just basically elongating my eyes like so now I'm going back in with a concealer more my shade so I'm using the Fenty Beauty concealer this time I'm gonna try to lift up my face so I go from the corner and then I drag it up okay I'm just gonna blend the hell out of it Now that I have the concealer done, I'm gonna go to contour slash my camera literally died when I was in the middle of talking. It was so rude. Anyways, what I was saying is that I'm using the Too Cool Shading Bronzer thing. Take both of these and I put it underneath my cheekbones to lift up my face. And then 
I take the dark color to contour my nose and I just take my little buddy blend 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 and now to my favorite part the blush I'm gonna be taking the milk makeup cream blush and I just put it on the side of my cheeks and I blend it out with my fingers then I go in with the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Blush my blush, my brush and I just put it in the corner of my cheeks I just love blush, it just ties everything together it just makes you look so sweet and soft hopefully I didn't go too crazy I mean, if I did, that's okay. Because we got this thing. Ta-da! And this is kind of my most important part because I do not wear falsies anymore. I had a phase where all I did was wear falsies, but I just never looked good in them. So here's what my lashes look like. Oh. And now I'm gonna go in with highlighter and I'm using the Fenty Beauty Kilowatt and I actually broke it and so I just combined both of it into one pot just so it's easier for me but no it's not appearing on camera I'm gonna be adding nose highlight blend that out a bit I know the public doesn't do this anymore but I'm adding highlighter to the inner corner of my eyes because it makes my eyes pop out a lot more but Michelle Fawn told me to do this when I was in fifth grade and I trust her and it has been 10 years still going strong I like to add a little bit of glitter under my eyes oh that's too much glitter and I just think it makes my eyes look Pretty. Now I'm going to moisturize it with the EOSIS Extra Dry Lip Treatment. Here's my number one trick. So I use lip tint, but it is way too bright for me. So what I do is I grab, ugh, this thing is like busted. I use my Smith's chapstick take my lip tint I push out a little bit of product and then I dab just a little bit of lip tint onto the product and once you put it on your lip it's gonna look very very faint okay not right now but it's a little bit too bright for my liking but I think it should look okay and yeah let me Take out my hair and then I'll show you what it looks like. This is the face that people see in public, at work, or when I did go to work on dates, at school. Not school. I honestly don't care what I look like at school. This is it. I hope you guys liked my first makeup video. Hopefully I'll be able to improve if I decide to do more of these type of videos in the future. Otherwise, thank you for watching. I'm so glad that you came. And yeah, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye!